Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's time for another volume review, and this is going to be on the first volume of Love of Kill. Welcome once again, guys. Thank you so much to Yempress for providing this copy for me to review for you guys. Uh, this is a brand new series that Yempress is releasing, and you guys can buy it online. Uh, I will leave uh, the the links in the description below, so make sure you go support Yempress. I have said it once, and I've said it I really Many times, the Impress is probably one of the best companies that we have here in the U.S. when it comes to manga and anime and uh, light novels. They just do so much for the community. Uh, so do give them some love, please. Um, love of Kill, uh, genre-wise, I would put it in action. I would put it in maybe a little bit of gore. It, it, it depends how uh, uneasy your stomach is. Uh, and then... Um, romance <laughs> and i'll explain that question mark in just a bit but before anything guys if you have not done so by now subscribe to my channel uh there is a giveaway happening so go check that out um go check out my other yen press uh, manga reviews and light novel reviews that i have in my channel uh they they provide a lot of stuff so go check them out as well as the manga hauls which i i, I assure you almost every single one has some yen press books uh so give them some love uh let's talk about this first volume now uh volume one like every volume one obviously introduces the story but also uh gives us time to introduce the characters so we have two main characters obviously there's more but our two main characters that we see in the cover and in the back is going to be a uh, song which is the guy he is a infamous uh serial killer um or or assassin i guess you can call him he his job is to go and kill people um so much that he's grown a reputation that a lot of people want to kill him in return right he he's wiping out leaders left and right wiping out you know people that are being um chased by the law and chased by mafia he's basically a, a mercenary of today's time he is you know, whoever wants to pay, well, he'll he'll deal with it, right? And then we have this girl Chateau, and Chateau is, um, she kind of works also for an organization that seeks bad people and cleans up the mess, right? She she goes and elim eliminates people that needs to be eliminated. Um, now, as a reader and as a I, I don't even know, a sympathizer, I guess, for song. Um, I read this and I'm like, okay, their profession is not so different from each other. <laughs> like, he's just hired by different people, whereas hers is viewed as, you know, kind of a government cleanup type of deal. But at the end of the day, it's the same thing. They're going off to uh, a kill and assassin people. And, and, I'll, and I'll explain why it ends up being the same thing. Because uh, throughout the volume, we get flashbacks of how Song and Chateau met for, for the first time. And essentially, she was off to get a kill and he had already... Uh, killed the person and essentially gives uh, the 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 body to her as a present and uh, he does weird stuff like smelling her and him realizing that it doesn't make him want to barf which you know you know you're, you're kind of like does that really happen to you usually and apparently it does <laughs> so uh he he falls in love it's like a uh, you know at, at first sight falling in love um with chateau so he ends up essentially working her cases and uh every so often throughout the, the volume he basically calls her and lets her know, hey, you can pick up the body at so and so place, and you you guys will be, you know, you, you you'll be able to retreat the body and make your cut. The story gets interesting in two parts. Uh, one, they go out on a date, and obviously Chateau works with other people, and they think that they see her. Obviously, they do see her, but they they blame it on the alcohol or or their 
or them being tired, something like that. Uh, but yeah, she is going out with the enemy. Now, Song actually has a quite a bit of a reputation. So Chateau's company actually is going out to kill him. He's one of their targets. So they're not supposed to be together. That's a big no-no, right? You don't go out with the people that you're supposed to kill. So she's out with this guy and she, in their relationship, you can tell she doesn't want to do it. She She's only doing it because she's getting these free kills essentially, right? So she's very off put. She's very serious. She's like, she rarely responds with words. Uh, where our song is, he's a teenager boy. Like he, he just wants to talk. He wants to do stuff. Uh, let's go here. Let's do that. And if she doesn't like something, he'll, you know, he'll change it up. Like he wants her to just be there with him. And he's all giddy as he can be. Um, and, and, and again, they do explain it in, in the story for his personality that is extremely extremely rare now it, this the story also continues with um uh, an, an ending that i don't want to share because it's just too much information to give out but essentially uh someone in his realm of work finds out what's going on and uh you know chateau doesn't become as safe as she thinks she is so uh that in a nutshell is the story itself i don't want to give too much more details just because um you know i want you guys to actually read it but the 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 story itself uh i, I would say it's very comical in in some parts uh but for the most part i would say action and uh led uh, before anything um what really makes it a great story is just how very similar yet opposite of characters uh, Song and Chateau is. Um, I, I If you're looking for romance, I wouldn't say this one is like the best romance thing. But if you're looking for like a, com a comedy romance that has action, that has uh, a good, I would say good plot behind it, uh, Love Kill is really the one that you guys want to go with. Um the story itself is intriguing. The artwork, uh, it, it's I would say it's great. I, it, there's a lot of mini uh, stuff uh, towards the end of uh, of chapters, and I'm tr trying to find a good example after after it. But they they changed their artwork of um, kind of like the the mini stories to a more comical side, um, and, and they give you information of each character. But also, they give you kind of like side stories uh, or side comments that you probably it wouldn't wouldn't fit so well in the chapter, but it, it makes the the manga just so much more funny. So um, yeah, personally, out of ten, I will give this one a seven out of ten. Um, I I wish it it uh, it did a little bit more when it came to Chateau's character. We got so much of Song, but not really a lot of her. Uh, so, and, and again, it's because she wasn't responding a lot. She's trying to be as cold as possible towards Song. But I wish I, we knew what her true feelings were, uh, at least a little bit, a, a small hint. Uh, but we didn't get that in the first volume. Now, uh, there's a huge cliffhanger at the end and it's a pretty good cliffhanger uh enough where it makes me at least want to read volume two so i think it's it's deserving of a seven uh so go check it out again all the links to where you guys can buy um this this manga volume will be in the link it will be in the description below uh you guys can check them out uh through different retailers um but i, I believe yem press if you go to their actual website which again description below they will give you like all the different options of where you guys can buy the actual manga so Barnes and Noble right stuff Amazon uh, they include even the, the digital versions if you want to get a digital version so um, there there's no excuses you can read it go check it out uh, it's it's an easy read you guys will finish it pretty quickly and we'll be wanting to read volume two so thank you again for watching this guys if you have not done so by now subscribe to my channel uh, comment Comment, like and share this video uh, so that Yem Press can be promoted. Uh, thank you again to Yem Press for promoting and, and, 
and giving me this copy for me to to review for you guys. And guys, with nothing else to say, don't be strangers. See you guys in the next review.